Recently, I've gone through a lot of comments on this channel, and one thing I noticed is that many of our subscribers hate Sora 2 and VO3. Do you know why? The reason is simple and predictable. It's because VO3 and Sora 2 are extremely expensive, and there are no tools offering them for free. And I completely understand your situation. If you're a content creator or someone just trying to explore AI tools, hitting paywalls after just a few generations is incredibly annoying. That's exactly why I made this video. Today, I'll show you how to use Sora 2, VO3, and even Nano Banana Pro completely for free. By watching this video till the end, you'll get exactly what you're looking for. As a bonus, we're going to test these tools side by side using the same complex prompt so you can clearly see which one performs better and which one is perfect for your project. For now, take a look at these clips that I generated. Grab it! Tie it around the railing! It's slipping, I can't hold it! You've got it! Don't let go! Water's coming in faster on the north side. We're losing access points. On stranded civilians, third floor, yellow building. Oh, we can't stay here. Ropes ready. Two up front, one covering the current. Grab it. Tie it around the railing. It's slipping. I can't hold. Convoy, hold formation. Something's coming from above. Confirm, leader. It's a dragon. We keep moving forward. We are not alone. Convoy, hold formation. Something's coming from above. Confirm, leader. It's a dragon. We keep moving forward. By watching these, can you guess which clip was made using Sora 2 and which one came from VO3? Drop your answers below before getting into the video. And one more thing, please hit that like button and subscribe to support the channel. I created this video to help solve your frustrations, so show some love to keep the good stuff coming. The first thing you have to do is click the link in the description below, and it will take you straight to the tool. The tool is called Gemini Gen AI. Once you are on its homepage, you can see there is a pricing page, but do not worry guys, they are offering Sora 2 and VO 3.1 for free. Please wait until I show you how it works. Now from the top right corner, click on sign up and choose Google to sign in. After that, you will be redirected back to the homepage. At the top, you will see a counter showing 40 credits. This is where many people get confused and think they need to pay. But let me explain this clearly. Sora 2 and Veo 3.1 fast work completely free. They do not consume any credits at all. So even though you see those 40 credits, you can ignore them. These models literally cost zero. Next, go to the top menu and click on Studio. This is where all the work happens. Once you are inside under video generation, you can switch between different video generation models like Sora, Veo, and Grok. Grok is still under development, so ignore it for now. First, let us choose Sora and test how well it works. From here, I am selecting the Sora 2 free model. If you choose Sora 2 Pro, it will cost credits, so make sure you stick with the free version. Next to it, you will see an option to add an image reference. I will show you how that works at the end, so for now, leave it empty. Then paste the prompt into the prompt box. This prompt is designed to generate a cinematic sequence. It starts with a low angle wide shot of a dystopian industrial megastructure, followed by armored trucks moving through the desert. Then it shows a 25 year old woman speaking to her team, followed by a massive dragon chasing them. One of her partners responds, and the scene ends with a powerful and motivating dialogue from her. You can find this exact same prompt in the description below. Now choose the aspect ratio according to your project. Keep in mind that when using Sora 2 for free, you cannot change the resolution or duration. Once everything is set, you can see that zero credits will be consumed. Now click on generate and wait for the process to complete. Since this is free, it may take a few minutes. After waiting, here's the generated video. Convoy, oh hold formation. Something's coming from above. Confirm, leader. It's a dragon! We keep moving forward. We are not alone. As you can see, Sora 2 absolutely nailed it. The video followed the prompt almost perfectly. But before giving a final review, we also want to see how well this works with VO 3.1. Before that, let us try one more example using Sora 2. Repeat the same steps as before, but this time paste a prompt designed to generate a Pixar style video. This will help us compare both realistic and Pixar style outputs using Sora 2 and VO 3 and see which one performs better. Once again, click on generate and wait for the process to finish. Here is the result. Keep running. Don't look back. Almost there, almost. Deep growl then. No! Bridge! Just a little farther! 
I know many of you are waiting to see the VO 3.1 results for comparison, but before that, let me show you one last example using Sora 2 with an image reference. Go back to the studio section and upload an image from your device, then paste a prompt that explains how you want the image to be animated. Scroll down and you will notice that the credit usage is still zero. At the top right corner, you can also see that we still have all 40 credits left. Now click on generate, and here is the result. <laughs> Actually, the result looks good, but it did not do exactly what I asked. I asked for a scared facial expression and for the character to run backward, but that did not happen here. All right, now it's time to generate all of these videos using VO 3.1. So first, switch to VO. From the model versions list, choose VO 3.1 fast. If you use VO 3.1 normal mode, it will cost you 100 credits per video. If you use VO2, it will cost 20 credits per video. But VO 3.1 fast mode is completely free. So make sure you select that if you want to generate videos without spending any credits. Next, I am pasting the same cinematic shot prompt that we used in the first Sora 2 test. After that, choose the aspect ratio. Now you can see that it will consume zero credits to generate the video. So click on generate video and wait for the process to complete. Since this is VO 3.1 fast mode, the generation takes much less time. And here is the generated video. Convoy, hold formation. Something's coming from above. Confirm, leader, it's a dragon. We keep moving forward. What do you think about it? I will compare the results from both tools and show you the final winner at the end of this video, so stay tuned. Now let us paste our second prompt to generate a Pixar style video. Before clicking on generate, make sure VO 3.1 fast mode is selected. Then choose the aspect ratio and click on generate video. After waiting a short time, here is the result. The video looks fantastic, and it followed the prompt exactly as we requested. Now comes the final test using a reference image. But here is the problem. VO does not support video generation with a reference image. If you want to create a video using a reference image, you must use the Sora 2 model. This is definitely a drawback of this tool. If you want to view all your generated videos, go to the top menu and click on History. All the videos you generated will appear here. As you can see, I have generated many videos and the remaining credits are still showing 40. But remember, all generated videos will be deleted after 7 days, so make sure to download any important videos to your device. Before going to the next feature, let me quickly show you something interesting. You know, we're always exploring amazing AI tools like image and video generators, but have you ever thought about actually making money with the content you create? Here's a super simple way to monetize your AI-generated photos, videos, or any type of content. It's a platform called DFans, and the best part is it handles most of the hard work for you. Instead of spending hours chatting, promoting, and selling manually, DFans gives you an AI chat assistant that talks with your fans, promotes your work, and even sells your content while you sleep. Pretty wild, right? So let me quickly show you how it works. Once you click the link in the description, you'll land on the DFans dashboard. Just hit the Become a Creator button, and you can sign up in seconds using your email or Google account. After that, you'll set up your profile with a photo, a display name, and a short bio location, and finally click Save. Remember, this is what your fans will see. Next, you can create your own subscription tier. For example, you might offer AI artwork packs, behind-the-scenes prompts, or custom edits. Set your price, add some perks, and even create a promo bundle with a discount to attract new subscribers. Now here's the game changer, the AI chatbot companion. With just a few clicks, you create an AI version of yourself that automatically chats with fans, builds engagement, and sells your content directly. You simply upload your images, videos, or any files you want to sell, set the price, and the AI does the rest. You can even customize the chatbot prompt. For example, if a photo shows you in a red dress, it could say, Would you like to feel the texture of this red dress? This makes the chat feel real and personal. From there, everything is managed in one place. Your posts, your fan messages, your sales, and even your earnings in crypto like USDT or ETH. It's super beginner friendly and saves you so much time. Also, DFans is 100% AI friendly, meaning your account will never be banned for using AI. Unlike other platforms where a single ban can freeze assets or lose customers, DFans is safe and even welcomes creators who were banned elsewhere. 
Plus, unlike other platforms where support is slow or automated, DFans provides real human customer support that responds within 24 hours. They've also added a new AI analysis feature that helps you track your performance and understand what's working across your content. So if you're creating cool AI images or videos already, why not turn that into income? Check the link in the description, give DFans a try, and start monetizing your content today. Earlier, I also mentioned that you can generate images using Nano Banana Pro for free. To do this, go to the Imagine section and choose Nano Banana Pro from the list. You will also see some default styles that you can select if you want. Now paste your image generation prompt, choose the aspect ratio, and click on Generate. Here is the result. Now let us compare the results from Sora 2 and VO 3.1. After watching the first cinematic results from both tools, the choice is quite clear. Sora 2 performed much better than VO 3.1. The result from VO 3.1 fast mode has several issues when compared to Sora 2. However, this could be because we used the fast mode. VO 3.1 normal mode would likely produce much better results. Now here are the videos generated from both tools for the second test. Keep running! Don't look back! Almost there, almost! Deep growl then! No! Bridge! Just a little farther! I think both results look good and followed the prompt exactly as requested. Now I want you to comment and tell me which one is the winner. Please leave a comment below and share your opinion. I hope this video helped you solve your frustrations with Sora 2 and VO 3.1. You can now use both of these tools completely free and without limits. Just remember not to expect extremely high quality results when using free modes. If this video helped you, please hit the like button and subscribe to support the channel. Also, do not forget to watch our other AI tutorial videos. They can help you a lot as a content creator.